Hi, Nick Collier here, and this is my shop. Come join me. We'll have some fun. Okay, well, another Frankenstein setup here. Um, you can look down further and see I got it on an angle block. I got it squared up. Still a mess. But it's centered. The, the uh, rotary table is centered and the piece is centered. And uh, I used my little pointer to get that pretty much where we want it. Now we'll take that pointer out. Let's do that one more time. Okay. And we'll put ourselves at 3 8 no bit in. And this is one of those chances where you, you get to use a mill bit because the sides are in perfect condition. They've never been used. And this whole thing got just chewed. So I'll be able to run this down and set it up and make my cuts without uh, using up another bit. Of course, you know, I wouldn't use it up. But I get to use this one. Okay, so now we bring this out until we get to um, our uh, size, which is 1760. So Seven six zero, oh, but that is not centered. Well, can we just go with what we've got here? I think so. <clears throat> so we're gonna. It looks like we're a little shy of our hole. 1760. Oh, we'd go with it. Um, so, uh, we're going to plunge down and then we're going to cut a radius of, oh, I don't know, probably 30,000 or 30 degrees. Maybe less. Hard to know. Uh, we're going to slow the mill down. Let's see if we can even, even chew this thing up. Oh, yeah. It's going down.
All right, let's give it a test and see if we got to get it. Can fit it. Okay, so we've got our slot. Now let's go over to the other side and come back to zero. There's zero. Okay, and what's our number? Seven six D. One seven sixty. Looks like we're going to land just right. Okay, we're coming in and testing to make sure that the bolt holes are going to fit the bolts. So, check the minor diameter. And we're in pretty good shape. There's a lot of room. And the major diameter. I'm thinking we got plenty of room. Probably about 50 thousandths right there. So, time to dismantle this thing and see what we came up with. Do the real test. All right, here we go. Let's drop it in. Yep, no problem. That's going to be good. That'll be able to rotate that far. Yeah, I like it. Okay, so we'll be back tomorrow to do more. Okay, well the next step in this whole process is getting this plate, which is the bottom plate, to bolt to the um, table of the surface grinder. So, uh, and I think what I want to be able to do is rotate this too. Now I don't have to rotate it, but uh, I think it's probably a good idea. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is find zero here. First off, All right. 
there's zero. And then we'll slide this in and get it to zero out. Probably a good idea to get this somewhat bolted down. Now let's square it up by going up against the back of the mill. That's pretty good. Now we find our center. And I think probably the best way at this point <laughs> is crisscross. Doesn't have to be an accurate center, just something that's close. This will work. Somewhere right in the middle of there. pretty good then we come back in with our square and square everything up and unfortunately I'm going to have to drop it down a little bit further And I'm thinking that's going to be okay. <clears throat> On the money snug everything down a bit I know my alarms going off all right so we're center center center
take that out. Let me get a couple things set up and I'll be Okay, back. so we're dead center. And what we want to do is come out however far on both ends and drill two holes. And that way that when we get ready to set it up, <clears throat> well, it's not going to be accurate anyhow, no matter what. So we'll just uh, drill our holes and then come back with the mill bit and do, oh, maybe 30 degrees or something like that. So our first hole is going to be, oh, damn. I haven't got it up on a, on a platform. Well, Okay, such is life. We start back from step one. Because I'm not about to drill a hole in my, oh, wait a second, no. We're okay because we've got our slots. How far does the slot go in? I can't remember. that far not far enough all right well we're gonna set this up on a platform and we'll okay, be okay we're here again uh, we put it up on a couple of pieces of key stock and that should take care of everything that we need to do here let me get my guard back up We come out to some random place. Make sure that we're going to miss the key stock. One nine hundred. Sounds good. Yep, we're going to miss. And since this mill bit isn't quite enough to uh, reach all the way down that full one inch, although it could possibly, let's just see what it looks like. Now there's all the way down and that's beyond it. So we'll just do it in halves. I don't know while we're here we may as well take it the full 60 degrees and that way 
if we ever need to, we can come off and I mean, it's going to take another few minutes.